What up? What up? What up, Night Nation? It's your boy, Stevie Knight. About to get on one of these things. You feel me? What's good with my Patreon family? What's cracking with y'all, man? Hey, um, little birdie on Twitter. <laughs> Different for me. Twitter. I'm never on Twitter, man. I got to do better about getting on Twitter, man. Dropping me little gems. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, it doesn't look like there's an actual versus about to take place, but I guess Math Hoffa had a discussion on this podcast about how a versus would go down between Eminem and Busta Rhymes. Uh, that's pretty cool, man, because because uh, I don't know when it was. It had to been a it had to been a year or two ago. I'm trying to remember who I was. I, th I think it may have been Eminem. Cause I I always post a lot of stuff about verses on my uh, Instagram when I become aware of you know different artists competing or whatever. And Busta Rhymes came up in the conversation, and I think it was somebody that could potentially go go against Eminem, man. Uh, oh, I know what it was. I know what it was. I said that I don't think anybody can see Busta Rhymes, but I forgot who it was that made that come up in the conversation. Made that made that. Made that be my focus on whatever I was talking about on IG because it was so long ago. When did they start doing verses? Yeah, it must have been. Like it must, I can look at my IG post and figure it out. It must have been like a, at least a year or two ago, and I said that I don't. At that time, I don't think anybody can see Busta Rhymes, regardless who you are, because in the verses, it's about the performance, and you know what I'm saying. I remember posting that. I posted it on my IG story. I said, who can see Bustin' Rhymes in the verses? And and that's what it was. Of course, a lot of uh, people's opposition on that was Eminem could see Busta, right? And here we are. This they're going to discuss it. I'm just going to dive into what my thoughts about it. I may, not, I may not even need to dive into this, man, because it, I may not even need to dive into, you know, uh, Math Hoffa's debate or what have you because... Um, watching that recent uh, watching that recent Dipset in the Locks versus man, that opened your boys' eyes, opened a lot of people's eyes. I had to, because I know the majority of y'all who are not like Lock stands, the majority of y'all assumed that Dipset was gonna kill Locks because. Locks absolutely, I mean, uh, Dipset absolutely has more bangers. They got more slaps. They got more slaps in the locks. But what took place during that versus, man, that versus was so crazy. I did a whole reaction to it, like reaction to like the highlights or whatever. Like Jada Kiss pretty much decapitated uh, Dipset by himself because he outperformed him. He outperformed him. And we're talking about verses, man. That's what it comes to stage presence, performing, and what rapper out there can outperform Busta Rhymes? Discography aside, and please believe Busta has a mighty discography. A mighty discography. This boy, he go back to the, the late 80s. You know what I'm saying? So, we're not even taking it there, but just on stage performance, energy, rocking the crowd, bro. <sighs> And after seeing what Jada did to Dipset, I, I, that makes me even more confident in saying that I don't think anything, I don't think anybody can see Busta, Eminem included, man. Like the only only way I think Eminem would push the 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 decision in his favor is because of stands, like the stands we're talking about who don't see anything outside of Eminem. You know what I'm saying? But. You're going to bring some objectivity to it, man. Even y'all stands got to know that Eminem cannot outperform Buster. He may got slaps. He got, you know, rockers and stuff, man. But if, if, and just based on the discography alone, man, of course, Eminem has more numbers, but that's a whole different conversation. We talking about going to a stage, rocking it with your bangers and what you've attributed to uh, hip hop, man. I'd have to, I would give the nod to Buster off, off top. With some objectivity to it. Jada Kiss opened my eyes a lot to what takes place in the verses too, man. Because I always assumed that the decisions, the, the decisions being made were literally in the fans' hands. Which they are in the fans' hands, man. But Dipset got some delusional, you know, delusional stand type fans as well, man. And I, I, I think the majority of them would even have to admit that uh, Dipset got torched. You know what I'm saying? So, But I don't know if... 
I don't know if Eminem stands could have that same ob- objectivity because stands do not have any objectivity when it comes to Eminem. So I don't. We'd have to figure out a way to navigate through all that. But objective audience, <laughs> objective fans of music, man. Uh, I think the most objective fans, or even you know Eminem fans, as long as you ain't a stand, I think the I think the most objective ones would have to. If if Busta went out there and just outperformed Eminem, bro, I think the the majority of the more rational people watching it would have to side with Busta taking that. <clears throat> and then we want to talk about bangers, bro. Like you know, Locks did it. They they uh, lined their songs perfectly up to counter everything that Dipset did. Like Dipset, they 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 had slap after slap after slap after slap, but. Jada countered and encountered and encountered and encountered and then came up there and just rapped. And just rapped. Just out rap dipset. And I think, like I said, I think Buster will outperform Eminem. I don't know if we out rap him. Anybody can just go out there and out rap Eminem. Even though I did these Eminem versus series and Buster's one of those artists that to me and calm down, I gave that nod to Buster. But even if for those who said Eminem won that, it wasn't no, it wasn't no overwhelming victory that Eminem took in that, on that feature. Like they was neck and neck. If you if you want to give it to Eminem, it wasn't by a landslide. It was close. So you talking about rapping too? <sighs> Come on, man. Come on, man. Like Buster don't get his flowers. They don't. Buster doesn't get the appreciation he deserves. He's even though he's been around, done it as long as he has. He he is very very underrated as a rapper, man. He can do it all. He can do it all. So, I, I mean, I've had this discussion, too. I don't know what it is distinctly about Buster Rhymes' career where people don't you know, throw his name in these conversations about, like, the, the goats and the tops and Mount, Mount Rushmore rappers because, I mean, in a booth on a feature, you know Buster on a song with you, you got to come with it or he's going to take your head off. He's one of those. He's going to take your head off. So, um, yeah, man. <laughs> I ain't even get into it. I don't even need to get into it, man. And then I find... <sighs> If I do, if I, uh, just thinking about it, if I click on, if I react to Math Hopper's debate, they're going to demonetize me anyway. I don't even need to hear what they got to say. I'm more curious as to what y'all going to say, man. Come on, man. Like, objectively, though. Put it like this. Do y'all think Eminem can outperform Busta Rhymes live on stage? All right? First question. Comment below. What do you think? And discography-wise, man. Taking that, take, taking that in consideration, do you think Eminem's catalog is that much more better than Busta Rhymes' catalog if you think Eminem's catalog is better than Busta Rhymes' catalog? I, 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 I rocks with Eminem. That's, 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 that's the guy. You know what I'm saying? But I got to call a spade a spade, man. I don't think anybody, anybody is going to be able to touch Busta Rhymes on the verses. I, I, would, say, I would say Drake because of the slaps, but you can't you can't really compare those rappers because um, it's like new era versus old era. You can't really do that. You gotta you gotta get rappers that fall in line, fall along the lines of like the same era. You know what I'm saying? But and taking that into consideration, I don't think anybody that is comparable to Busta as a rapper with eras, longevity, impact. And the closest person I could come up with on top of my head would be Eminem. Like, I don't think anybody can see Busta Rhymes in a versus. Nah. Nah. I'm, looking, I'm going through the comments. Yeah, people got... Yeah. It looks like from the comments, it's pretty much a toss-up. It's pretty much a toss-up. It is because someone being a better rapper has nothing to do with nothing. That ain't that ain't that ain't got nothing to do with nothing. Stage presence, bro. That's what it is. And uh, yeah, Buster's a monster. Buster will make you want to rip your face off. <laughs> he makes you want to rip your face off. Like. <clears throat> so, anyway, yeah. Curious to hear y'all thoughts, man. <laughs> uh, if your first time pulling up, go ahead and press the subscribe button real quick, man. Join the family, Night Nation. We out here all day, every day, grinding to grow, growing to grind all the time. Patreon family, love y'all, appreciate y'all, thank y'all for everything, man. Life is bars, shopstevenight.com, man. I'm out.